Hey, I'm working on a project in my backyard that is really turning out so pretty and I want to share it with you. So this is part of me preparing for the upcoming healing watercolor workshop for women. And this workshop is all about taking the pressure off. You know that pressure, if you've tried to do art or you haven't tried because you think, oh, I'm not good at art or whatever. This is about removing all that pressure and just enjoying what art can give you in terms of self-care and meditation and just a beautiful activity and what better place to be doing it than in my backyard. So these designs I did, oh and here's another one. I started with a stencil. What could be simpler? So in this case I just did the stencil straight up and then did watercolors and gold ink. If it was smaller, it would make a good card. I could fold it in half and just make it a card. Why not? I could stick it in a frame. I mean, really, you get beautiful results and there's no reason to put pressure on yourself to be able to draw so well or to be able to do it right. There is no right. Art is for fun and art is for healing and meditation and it is just a wonderful process. And the way to get good at it and the way to get results you want is to practice, practice, practice. So using stencils is a good chance. There's a butterfly stencil. It's a good chance to practice things, practice the painting part without worrying about the drawing part. And you can get all kinds of stencils. I just want to get your creative juices flowing by checking out some of the possibilities. I mean, it's so cute. You can layer it in with other art that you are drawing. It can give you a good chance just to mix things up and do things in a different way. You can put a bunch of different stencils together and create a whole garden picture, whatever. Mine are butterflies and flowers because that's the kind of stuff I like, but there's stencils of all different kinds of things that you can get. And then it's just a matter of, whoops, it's just a matter then of enjoying the process and really just enjoying laying down colors, seeing how they swirl, just relaxing into it. So I'm going to spend some glorious time outside today working on this and getting it finished. I may add black outlines or another color of outlines, or I may just leave it. I don't know how it's going to turn out. And that's part of the fun. So I hope this, whoops, things are blowing around now. The dangers of working outside. <laughs> I hope this is sparking some inspiration in you about how you can enjoy art without all the pressure. The pressure that we put on ourselves, right? It's all in the, in the mindset. Um, and just be able to enjoy a beautiful afternoon in the backyard like I am with Walter. I don't know if you can hear him. He's sort of making snorting noises over to the side. Um, but yeah, this is what the Healing Watercolor Workshop is all about. This is just one of the techniques we're going to be learning. We're going to be doing lots and lots and lots of experimental painting and fun stuff, and it's going to be amazing. So I hope to see you there. 